My name's Tim Wardle. I'm the director of Three Identical Strangers, which is premiering at Sundance 2018 in the US documentary competition. The film opens with a young guy going to college in 1980, upstate New York. It's a small college. He's never been there before. He's a freshman. But when he turns up, everyone greets him like he's been there for years. People are hugging him, girls are kissing him, guys are slapping him on the back. He doesn't know what's going on. And eventually, someone comes up to him and says, I think you've got a twin brother. As soon as they meet, it's instantly apparent that they are identical brothers, separated at birth. The next day, they get a call from someone who says, I'm reading about you guys in the paper, and I've seen a picture of you, and I look just like you guys. I think I'm the third. I think we're triplets. And that's the beginning of the story. I mean, that's just the setup. And the film explores what happens after that. The, the hard thing about this film is it's really tricky to talk about it without giving too much away. I'm, the, the boy's story takes unbelievable twists and turns, and it's very hard to talk about the, the film in any way without, without giving those away. I really want people to go and see this film and it to take them on a journey and they start in one place and end up somewhere completely different. At its heart, there's a really warm human story, a very personal story about these, these three brothers. Um, but it allows you to explore much bigger themes of, of family, free will, destiny. I feel really privileged to be able to tell this story. It's taken five years to bring it to the screen. When we were making the film, various people had told us about previous attempts to, to make the story and, and said, you'll never, you'll never get this finished, you'll never be able to finish it. You know, people have tried before and it's been shut down every time. There are a lot of conspiracy theories about this story and about why it hasn't been told in the past. So the whole way through, we never knew if we were going to make it to the end, but I'm really pleased that we did.